So Mike, when did you start skating? I started skateboarding in December of 1996. I was living in Texas at the time, and I skated there for about a year and a half before I moved up to Arkansas in 1998. When did you start filming? I started filming around 2000. It was just my friends and I going out to the Van Buren Skate Park, just kind of filming there and filming skating street around Van Buren. Nothing serious. We didn't really make any videos. It was just us going out every day and just documenting what we did. So Mike, did you uh, ever go to school for this? Yeah, I went to the University of Central Arkansas and I got my undergrad in digital filmmaking in 2006, which I never really saw it, that I saw it after that I would be filming skate videos entirely, which isn't all I do, but that's predominantly what I do now. How many videos is the is this how many videos is this now that you've done this is my fourth full-length video that I've been working on and I've done two promos I did a waste of time in 2006 with Nick Gibson and then I did the FYC promo in 2006 I did lurking hard in 2008 I did a promo schizophrenic birthday party in 2009 I did Caution Weird Load, a full-length video in 2009, and this is my fourth full-length video, Mental Breakdown, 2011. Who are your main influences in your filming? My main influences in filming with skateboarding has definitely been Joe Castresi, who films for Alien Workshop. I've always liked their videos and the editing and style that he portrays, and over the last few years, it's really been uh, Mike Gilbert, films for Fallen and Zero. He's been a big influence in the way I've been directed towards filmmaking, and I've always liked Jamie Thomas with his fast, up-close cutting and editing that he does. How long have you been working on this project? I started working on Mental Breakdown around 2009. It started as actually a schizophrenic birthday party, and I ended up doing a promo, and I kind of abandoned that project and picked up Mental Breakdown. And I got sick for a while, so I had to postpone it, but Nick Gibson really stepped in and helped me out a lot with filming and picked up the slack that I left off on. That was our next question, was did you have any help with this project? Yeah, I couldn't have done this video without Nick Gibson, definitely. And all the other people that helped film this video are ones who contributed to this a lot. Uh, Jesse's friends up in Kansas City, some people in Fayetteville, and everyone around here that helped film. Thank you, and they couldn't have done it without you. Is there any part that you like the best? It's hard to say. I've you know, edited everyone's part. They're all really good. I guess if I have to have a favoritism, it's gotta be a fan beer and pride, so I'm gonna have to go with Jesse. There's been talks of this ending up in the hands of Jamie Thomas. What are your thoughts on that? I, I know for a fact that it's going to end up in the hands of Jamie Thomas. Um, my friend Judd Ferguson used to skate for Zero, and he's good friends with Jamie Thomas, and Jamie Thomas is going to get a copy of this video next week before the premiere. So, who knows what will happen there. When is the premiere? The premiere is February 3rd, it's a Thursday, at 7 p.m. at the Van Buren, Arkansas, Malco Theater. Videos will be available for $5. And this is what the video looks like. And all your contributions will go to pay for the cost of the video.